evening, lovely viewers. You're tuning to HSM TV and you're watching The Awakening, your number one Christian discussion program. We thank the Almighty God for making it possible for us to come your way today, being the 10th day of July 2021. Indeed, it is by the grace of the Almighty God that we are seeing a wonderful day as this. I want to take this opportunity to acknowledge my sponsors, um, Heaven Seekers Ministry, a ministry that is aimed at bringing the undiluted gospel of the Lord to the world, especially in these last days. Also, we are being sponsored by Modest Apparel Fashion, Win Win Driving School, Vidoff Products, and his sub enterprise, Sam 138 Building and Construction Works, Sam 4 Metal Works, and Desert Construction Works. In due time, we are going to be putting out their numbers so that you'll be able to reach out to them for all your needs uh we thank the almighty god once again as i said uh, this is the awakening on hsm tv my name is pastor prince crunchy and i'm going to be your host i have with me here my wonderful panelists for today but before i introduce my panelists i want to inform you that we are streaming live on all our social media platforms so you can also be a part of it even if you are away from home you can watch us on facebook and also you can send your comments your questions your contributions on Facebook, I will be able to read them out in due time. And also, the WhatsApp number is 050-444-0256, 050-444-0256. You can start sending your WhatsApp messages even as the program commences. Um, one, wonderful welcome once again, uh, Thank gentlemen. You, Thank you. I believe you're all doing fine by the grace of God. Amen. All right, so today with me is uh, my... Brother and colleague in the Lord, Pastor Enoch Adair. Pastor, please, you're welcome. Thank you. All right. And then, um, Elder Dr. Samuel Kisi, Doc, you're also welcome. Thank you, Pastor. All right. We thank the Lord so much. I believe that uh, we are always happy to be on this platform because it's a wonderful platform which the Lord wants to use to do many things in the lives of us and then many people out there. So without much ado, I'd like to come to you, Pastor. Um, last week... And in the previous weeks, I believe that we've been discussing something concerning a place where we're going to spend eternity. We've looked at hell, we've looked at heaven. And last week, we actually saw a, a pictorial description of what heaven looks like. And then the, the life that is being lived there by the saints and the, the beings who are there. And the life we, we also yearn to live when we, when we get there. So um, maybe, though... I believe that I've mentioned a few things, but then you, you can give us a quick recap of what you remember from the previous weeks, and then we zoom into today's topic of discussion. Na it make us actually say in the moon it make a kayo. A year be a internet, no one can eat us. The castle and monomia sedan and I ain't candidate. You make us a radish, a soft penny, your papa, so penny pipi crunchy, and here mammy Marie crunchy, the Philip Pi, Bushoning in a every sick as a soft for near Bushia or Shane and I radish will be a man. What's the end of constant saying here? Okay, you know, say a dear Baku and here power we are citrus in the Padrin Jane home. Nana se wa rena moso de betu ja se yemi mi ne ho yese asase su e ho se ye ye nchire bo wa e da se bo ye be free ha na ye free anu ma he fa ne ye ko e he fa ne ye kwa kwoti na e ye afebo e tu ntwada na se ne o kan ye hwe he ho se na no last week no e wa de nyankopon ye adom e de heaven be do e chire nyankopon do a wa de do ye se abra wo ka de ye hu chire ne wo ka de de nso so chire ye no mi ye hu no ni mi ye nyana ne ya hwe ne ye yiba ko now last week I read it. May you know, my people, the teacher, and the senior sima, you consider heaven a fire. A fire, senior, you could not see a teacher no. And then no more, what you could not. Now I read it. I do not mean you should read it. Now I read it. And the teacher will be a wise and see so. On the Christian, you should crumple by no. Can be be a fire heaven one or the dear wise and see so not to turn. The teacher said no. I do a wise and see so. I read it to turn heaven one. You do have in the end a very amplified version of the words as you know. To me, you know, send your heaven, no, na first you know, when you see the word keke, advice, and do not say, be a make us a keke name, no, but the emphasis are first you know, because men build in the young, you know, first you know, the first you know, keke cry, no, a boy, a boy, the near, what do you see, some first you know, a normal idea, you know, and in a fair year, 
ene ne kese pa ne Kristo anka so no ati kro no di hene wo e na hinie na odi hene wo ma ono ne ni mu hiren ba ye hiren ba bo no sine ni mu hiren che wo wiya so na wiya so so e kwa me nyi ni so bi wa sa so ti bi ne ni kan wo che o bi a ti mi hwa wiya o ya o hu kokoti o peje wani kakra nsu e be pro ne se ne be se e tu mo ana be kata na se oru ano e hiren che wiya de ana che so hiren pa na ono no e wa de na ye nua so me ti ase se sa abuo de nue no ne fe ban no e da ho e fe dada ne mu so be se hu ne fe ye pa je se sa to han to so na anko ye han bi anko ye wiya anko ye bo so me anko anko ye touch light anko ye bibia se oru ana nkasa na na ne mu hiren che wiya ono no han na e kwa koto so dia e na na me jiri se ye kure be hia ni fofuro enya mo wa se he be no you send ye ye ti ye se Ain't me for the Pabia in Coho. Call any Pabia ain't me, share we are the Anna, say, or run a hino. Ain't me, share. Jay, he answered by me and for a bit media as a reflective nature of semi city. No, you who say heaven or a hino, a yaka chip and send ye, the petty Tibia, Pabibio Monsem, no more pen on Alpha Mount Bamba, Kedimu. Out in Senipa, we are building a formidable mansion, and I say be an empire be. But yes, still, oh, but you bet you should be a fan of Pema work up one second. You have to be a crumah. Not just a assassin, so no way is secure. And for how you build your your place, your empire, how you protect yourself, no one is secured here. Eh, mm. uh -huh. you probably be very as here. Oh, my dear, to me, you have to do baby cannot use or more so we invincible. They were immortals, but they are the people who push them out of this earth. Our monthly as you be a chess, it will be a yes if we the moment you want to say heaven as a kingdom, no, and you're so secure, very secure. So when you have to remember what you have done, that you have already done, you have already done. Now they also are here within you. No, no, no. I'm not going to prove anything. You know, the sun is normal. We are seeing sun. We move here in heaven. So I say, you have to cry. You have to count. I say, I have to. Now you have to cry. I have to count. 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 I say, Boni, I dream Boni. Be here. You have to go down. So you have to cry. You have to cry. So, se ko kwa ta ba wa be fa ka. So, so de kwa ko ye de ba de. O bi an kon ko fa. So, ha o ka su o kwa ni e betu ako. E ti ehun se e fe. Na nya ne fe nko ne mum na ye konkon. E na nya konkon kwa ne mum na ye eh bambo kese e o ho a Awurde Nyankopon wa bofo a ono Nyankopon ka se obi an tumi no. E na ono wa sa wa bofo mi mighty angels. I in your reference from several years, Christ to catch Peter said for all sick and the same one. Some say me pack of four. I can call twelve legions. Exactly. Of angels, let us say, oh, those who are. If I'm behind the behavior, oh, but for the apple pudding, some money will hold. Now the chance to catch Peter by going home on a Friday, I'm so full of business. Eh, 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 you know, prior to heaven, you can't even say you can't share. You can't share anything. When he's not there, there's no heaven. Yeah. Oh, until only you can't go home. He who was, and I say we so wise and crafty enough. Say what he had designed such a place. You know, how does he look like? Oh, no one wants to be a bit of a sad. I know no one wants to say. So, your mommy can't change so free. I be bit too so say. Just imagine walking with the Lord. There is no fear. There is no anxiety. There's no nothing evil. There's no death. In fact, no man yesu was as if you know he been in heaven. Okay. He been in hell. And in China, a man yeah, I'm just so kesi. I'm here for my choice. I'm saying yes, it's only you. You be on your own. Say, and yes, and they they are ready. They're telling me, "Kwa hodo do do so." So, or kasachi le ba yu huna. So, yesu so heaven one day. I'm here one day. So one day I'm better. He will come in a bodily form. Say, I'm here. I'm not here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. You told me more, yeah, yeah. So, you know, ah, be be a bit so clear enough. I'm be guilty, be a name, and I maintain one sin. I don't know, I maintain we are say everything will be brought bare, so plain. The banya be be a monte, I say, come about to him, and all put together, no, a cock of ye joy unspeakable. Okay, and each year by I will have him. That mean you are castle, no, do I, and no, I mean I can't call a brim. Then I see a young cacran, so try no a good yabba. Fuki ami ano so na kwa se no o asaba eh eh ti o me o so ano dodo onu ma chesi o o so ano chuno o chuno fomu so anya dodo but anyway we are going to react and we are there yeah and I believe say whatever thing that comes to be spontaneous okay me jiri se wadi o how obesi 
article will be a feeling yeah. for us to respond to the love now was shown to us it meet me at a so we do a ready me one anima the only thing i will say is thank you baby come good i mean i thank you i have the american people for it depending on the love he has showed to us now it should be a spontaneous reaction and the praise and the worship yes samsung abuse and we are limited to the boy yes sorry already you want to new you want to you want to be before the Lord for like a thousand years mm. but you are limited as a human go to be quiet or yeah go on my yes sorry everybody now also what's not no so sorry just say oh dear one yeah but heaven those things are not there are not there it is for a thousand years for two thousand years if you want to bow before the king and worship him we can do it to the fullest and then the praise and the joy will be made complete amen amen so indeed we have gotten to understand that heaven is not a realm or an atmosphere as certain people perceive but mm -hmm. it is a place as the lord jesus said that i go to prepare a place for you yeah. if it hadn't been so i wouldn't have told you and for that reason there is a lot we are expecting to see in heaven yeah. as even the bible has made a, a vivid description of what the place looks like which the lord through my panelists made mention of last week I believe that we had a, a, a pictorial imagination of heaven and by God's grace today we're going to continue our discussion if you just tuned in this is the awakening on HSM TV and today we're going to look at the celestial journey the or the journey to the celestials if you may put it um, we want to look at we've talked about heaven we've talked about hell now our main focus for the remaining part of the um, time is going to be on heaven and how to get there um, Doctor, I'd like to come to you. You know, when someone aims at going to the uh, the United States, I believe that there are prerequisites, as in yeah. uh, there are certain things you need to get to be able to get there. So we've talked about heaven. We've talked about the need for us to get there and then the joy over there and all that. How do we get there? What are the requirements for one to get there? Or the criteria one should meet. Hallelujah. Yeah. Um, Pastor, God bless you so much. Again, you say God richly bless our daddy crunchy and mommy crunchy and the entire family and also our viewers and sponsors. Um, <coughs> looking at it from all perspectives, and then uh, one of the things I think to add to what the Lord by his message through Pastor Enoch just gave right now, uh, when you read Revelation chapter 2, verse 17, the Bible says that uh, when we get there, those who are able to overcome, he's going to give them a new name. A white stone with a new name then it tells me clearly that if i'm going to be given a name nobody can name someone or something if that thing is not yours mm. then it tells me clearly that what the name that i'm known of on earth to my heavenly father is on my real name mm. because he's my father it's just like when i'm in school secondary school when i was in school my friends had a name that they call me with so if my parents come to the school and they call me with my real name that they name they wouldn't find me unless they call me by the name that my friends call me but no matter how my friends call me on that campus or the name that they refer to me with yet it is not on paper what is so recognized is what my parents have named me with mm. the same way that on this earth our earthly parents have given us name but the one who made us and formed us the one who formed us and created us mm. the one created us and formed us <laughs> in any way that we bring it forward he is our father and he says he has a name in every kingdom prominent people and people who are recognized are given names mm -hmm. in the kingdom of uh babylon okay shadrach meshach and abednego that was the name that they were given, but they naturally said their names, their, their names were Azaria and all the rest. That, which means that wasn't their name, but then they were given names. Again, to when Joseph was also given office, he was given a name, Zaphonat Panea. Daniel too was given a name for that kingdom. So we go into a kingdom and he says that they that will overcome, I will give them a name that nobody knows except he that receives. So which means that is my name and i remember last week the lord through pastor you know when he was reading some of the accounts of people that have been to heaven or their last days mm. the lady said they call me by a name that i know of which means that is her name by heavenly father she was called with okay i don't want to be a bastard mm. 
Mm. If I go to hell, which means my father doesn't know me and I do not have a name. I want to make it to heaven so that my real father will name me. I want to know the name that my father calls me with mm. and not the name that I have on earth only. That is my ultimate one reason why I really want to see my father so that he give me a name. How then do I get there to see my father? Man, then we dream. Jesus Christ, heaven. Jesus Christ is not all about heaven. The reason why maybe you want to know Jesus is because you want to go to heaven. No. But heaven is all about Jesus. Mm. Heaven is all about Jesus. But knowing Jesus doesn't mean that. It, so, what if maybe Jesus never promised us heaven? Does that mean that we need not to give our life to him? Which means that first, knowing Jesus, he said he comes to save. What is salvation? Salvation is being set free. He gave us an example of how the father and the son relationship goes with the prodigal son. That son was first set free from the bondage that he was being, he was eating the, at the feed that was meant for swine. First he was set free. He was thinking that I could be set free and be made servant. Jesus Christ comes to die for us. And when he died for us, if we believe in him, that he's God, he's Lord, as we accept his lordship, he comes in and set us free from the bondage of sin. He has stated this in the scripture. Uh, in the scripture, I think we can, I think we can read more. All of it has been stated in the scriptures. Mm. Now, the next thing that also I realized that after he set him in free, the other point is that he also gave me dominion. Okay. Dominion on earth and in heaven. Dominion me di adin in aso. When we go to prison yard, the prisoner and the prison warden or the prison officer, they are all in the prison cell. Mm -hmm. They are all within the yard. But then one is under bondage yeah. and one is free. But they are all in the prison yard. So on earth, we are all on earth. But some are free, some are bound. Mm -hmm. Which means as long as you have not accepted Jesus as your Lord and Savior, you are not free no matter the amount of money that you have no matter the amount of knowledge you think you have acquired no matter the amount of degrees or the extent of your exploit or whatever you have traveled how far you've traveled or how knowledgeable of a lot of you can think you to be you are not free some people will say that i'm not addict and i don't have any addictions so no 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 you might not have all of the addictions but pride is the biggest addiction you can even you cannot even resist all those that are prideful they are competitors they always think there's a competition for them and it tells you clearly that you can never be free from the clutches of sin and from the realms of the enemy except you surrender your life to jesus the first prerequisite for me to get to heaven is first to know jesus to know him not just to know him as a person to know him not just to, to know who he is mm -hmm. but i need to know what he is knowing what christ jesus is is not knowing who he is i believe maybe as the studies goes on it will give us deep understanding on, on all of that when you read colossians chapter 1 verse 12 to 14. okay <laughs> Twelve to fourteen. Giving thanks unto the Father, mm. which has made us meet to be partakers of the inheritance of the saints in light, who hath delivered delivered us from the power of darkness and hath translated us into the kingdom of His dear Son, mm. in whom we have redemption through His blood, even the forgiveness of sins. Who is the image of the invisible? But I think it to the fourteen is okay. okay. Now he tells us clearly that the moment I accept Jesus, I've been redeemed have been purchased, have been translated. Other books refer to it, you've been translated mm. from the person of darkness and brought into the kingdom of his dear son. But he's still on earth. Okay. So which means the heavenly kingdom will begin to live that heavenly life even right on earth. That's the reason why the Bible says, as he is, so are we on earth. So he never said, as he was. He said, as he is. Which means right now, Christ is in heaven. Mm. But he said, as he is, so are we on earth. Then he tells me clearly that we will live the heavenly life 
right on it by having dominion we wouldn't be under bondage any longer we can all be in the same prison cell all right as a prison yard but there are people who are prisoners and there are people who are prison officers okay they are not the same some are there and they are paid some two are there and they are seven sentence some are there they are all there but then some are free they can eat what they want and some are there but they cannot eat what they want they, some are there they can sleep at the time that has been given unto them and some are there they can sleep at any time that they want to sleep some are there they have liberty to make any noise they want some are there they cannot even make any noise that they want some are there they are seen as strangers while some are there they are known by the law and for which cause whatever happens to them the state take full course for it but some are there if they die nobody cares let's say that there's a fire outbreak in the prisons or let's say the prison officer loses his life on in course of duty that person will be given the befitting barrier compared to a whole bunch of prisoners that die they will be given mass barrier it tells clearly for instance in ghana there was a time that some doctors had road accidents there's been several road accidents several but that doctors they were just three mm. although they were three it meant as thousands of people have died whereas there are many that have even died and we just found them and nipa 250 130 and we number them as 23 people have died but just the three doctors there was a, a whole blow on the nation because of their importance too then it tells us clearly that if i want to live on this earth anyhow i will die anyhow end up in hell anyhow demons torment me anyhow mm -hmm. and you end in the lake of fire anyhow but then if i want to go to heaven then it means that first just as he said we need to be set free mm -hmm. the setting free coming from christ jesus only by accepting to be lord and god by accepting him to be who he is and what he is when i accept that jesus then i begin to live the heavenly life right on edge before i go finally to the place so beloved when we want to get to heaven it means that we need to be set free we need to accept the lordship of our lord jesus christ live the heavenly life practice makes perfection as we are told so we need to practice here who has to perfect it over there that is what the law through our doctor is telling us if you just tune in this is the awakening on hsm tv we are discussing their journey to the celestials or their uh, celestial journey pastor i would like to come to you with that same question concerning the requirement for one to be able to make it to heaven i believe that doctor has given us quite a, a lot of information over there I, I don't know if you have something you want to add up real quick I want to reinforce the work and it's very important. Number one, I say already Jesus Christ and Kasa Kasa, or me who nipa qualified to go to heaven. Okay. And I say no work and it 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 it, but it sums up all the other qualifications. Well, Matthew chapter seven, verse twenty-one yes. downwards. I say you be I say me say already already in the back of the name of God you sure done it. Appear the the will of God. And they mean say only prophet me are going to in totality. You can't even abuma is somebody that does the will of God. Mm -hmm. But then the utmost will of God, uh, should I say, Mumu, the Shia Kakreva, the other one, my dear, because when they say it is the will of God that Jesus Christ, the Son of God, should be Lord and God over all people and all things. Mm -hmm. And I mean, here you can say you cannot bypass the Lordship of Jesus to enter heaven. In mm -hmm. fact, Pastor, you can, the Lordship of Jesus and heaven are inseparable yeah you cannot separate heaven from jesus and <laughs> even manusi from i i am speaking foolishly as a man as i see so korano yeah they are here for be a dna baby you cannot separate them from where no. they are uh, mean what is a, a, wed a wedding without a couple well it's a wedding <laughs> <laughs> fantastic <laughs> what is a wedding mm. without a couple yeah. mm. so you can have a couple uh, they are not wedding at, the, as at that time mm. but yeah 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 can't wear there there should mm. be a couple mm. so when you say you can see this the lordship of jesus cannot be separated from heaven yeah but anybody that will go to heaven must first accept jesus as his lord and god and savior again it and you can find that in philippians chapter 2 verses 10 and 11 when omir will say jesus has been highly exalted mm. and every knee must bow to him yeah 
and confess that he is Lord okay. to the glory of the Father. So everybody must accept that. And again, when you, you can write us of the Apostles chapter 2, verse 36, and chapter 10, verse 36. Again, it is the will of God that all men would come to repentance. Yeah. So second Peter chapter 3, verse 9. Or sing and go on chair in the bush or send a bishop to search. Name of no or turn a boise. Sans on the so be a bear and now a in a bag in such a He wants all people to repent, mm -hmm. to turn from our evil ways, to make a U turn, a honey egg or a honey egg. Men are my boss and quasso and so are the any. And you are the penal. It may not even in free. That is repentance. So if you want to ask, 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 you you can write us of the apostle chapter 17 verse 30 was it brand new in yanko pobu and he goes so but they will share the pain in our man in us will be yes so all cultures must submit to jesus proverbs 28 13. proverbs 28 13. pastor god bless you as of the apostle 17 30 was say first in a day now we see me culture in you we see me dna we see how they sign here no yeah no no when you have to you was in a day please talk that is the repentance aspect. Again, the will of God because my cousin, the main thing is that you can go to heaven. So under it, and again, you will find say, it is the will of God that his people should live in total and complete holiness. Especially and so, sign the chassis, and so say, come to a brother, come to a brother, pen in the If we say, what you say, me young copon, me a crunk, take a semus me a crunk. That means it is the will of God, say a bear crunk. And a crunk, and a second Corinthians seven one, I'm yati as I say, and your crunk, and so be a macum and we, name on my bonte, they may yadi, may pet, but two child holiness, and tea, second Corinthians seven one. Oh, <laughs> Will see the Lord okay. means that they will go to heaven, so you need to be pure on the inside. And I said, in a kind of over chapter first to Selenus 4 3. I can again, it is the will of God that none should perish. It's almost like the second one, make said, should turn to repentance. Mm. But we so it is the will of God that none should perish. Now, it is the job that has been given to us. Mm. Second Corinthians 5 19. Ebano. Okay. Me a Christian, I'm into me to we. Me a Christian, I'm into me a small girl, Juma. Because I am here, you know, more more coming when you are stolen goods and I may turn on. They want to be here, you are coming from, but when you are going, so it's a common sign. I'm going to pay the other person can you pay in a and come to Iran? Me go and ask me say no. And so on so by you are going Sunday and up Sunday and up a crowd and one time and one crowd and Corona by no. And up and up with the can one petition in pop. I'm going to go for we are we are shattered. So I'm going to so what kind of life is that? 
So elders uh, omu only uh, fitting shops. Eh, uh, fit omu. Kyo omu chank of four. A piece of four chank of four fit a four mukwa sorry. Omu muton ya ni adi ni na ni na. That's the right answer. Omu muton ya adi pamfoi. Messing four. But you are you man one yada. So omu mani pani wo hura na o karaji kwa kodi anye. Ya ni ane sa. Enti no oni pa ba pa ya bi oni pa. All shasa se anya ngoko pa pe dey say nobody should perish in bebem. Any se one ye be ya akra yifo. Ya be ya ngoko fo ya bi esika be bo anya ngoko pa juma. The good cause. Ya be bo. Se ni ya be ya. Ebi mo bo ya radi yesu kan se. Se ni pa wo jina bebi ya mumu ni ding. Yeah. Oka se heaven be bono. Heaven mono because wa bo juma papa. Ebi mo bo juma papa mo wu ya radi ni eko nyani omo. Doka so. Doka so. As chapter nine. O wu ye. Ena bo a bo juma no mani pebi. Any young quite no money, you're a go papa into a week, promise up with another one is uh, another uh, will of God, which is a criteria for making heaven is that it is the will of God that men should live peacefully together. Okay, I do very, very important. A young go papa, dear pa, say nipa, nipa, I was as kebet nasia boom, I was some dream. No, Hebrews 12 14, as you say, 12 14. <laughs> Mm. Was it was a command. So, Pastor Jira Chiren said, the sentence be a beginning with a verb, a uh, command. Mm. You can only do by <laughs> two things to a command. Either you obey or disobey. So, what's it when you pen in an temera sumji? Any concrete will be put here when you are ready. As soon as you are ready, you can go on. Just say, you have to 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 say, or see no man see any uncle for which he doesn't soon yet. You are there now. Can come by verse 19 or see the person to take out Jim Takra with Jim. I will be on a month. I didn't uncle Pom Pepper and say any partner or Moki come with you. Not a month among the human year and poor food. Many of whom you are now Muna will be ready a barbon. Will be ready a bonnet too. Will be ready to China second. I never have a bonnet. So it's in uncle Pona Pedian Sandy Pabet now. I'll soon be more. It's one on pass from your uncle heaven. A hint in what's in Shrania Patafo, yeah. In Shrania Patafo, as soon you for all over for young couple, my uncle for my own. Don't bet an impasta. Yeah, heaven. It means as a member quiet for the quiet gate, just say uncle for a pass from you. There will be an hour. My only answer now, how do you all a full for a mile and enjoy your be my own son, a Christian kind, the boarding room. A proposal idea will make heaven. And the last, uh, I think, say, no, it should be the last one, the last two pastor, my infancy, so you see, and I. Another will of God is that it is the will of God that He that created us will be able to use us in any way He deems fit yeah. for His own glory. Okay. Isaiah 43 verse 7. Now say a program a na mo superstar can once him very extensively radin shrub. So when you pebble once as to be an yanko pon born and say, go bet you be dying be a bed down in yanko pon in my dear. So as you put a bra pun yanko pon jumano, you put a brain person by more crama yanko pon do my idea mope. And in fact, Jonah testified to the fact that is hell. Bonsuni yam no kodayeno. All church they must say the bars of the earth had enclosed me. The jiri se wadi man an experience in hell. Send what they may be on the to me, then you'll be a teacher of hell. No, I catch as a car on a come as a girl. But what which is a journal feel you say the bars of the earth had enclosed me. As I say, no more and comes on and can't and can't tie this a prison. He had no a teacher to me, 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 was this any part in who free range now? Run to me, you are baby or baby. So Isaiah 43 7 or seeing young couple, baby or bony, didn't you know any man anymore? And so we should be people that will allow ourselves for God to use us for His glory. It's in the power which me, my whole camera, I didn't do your baby shit anymore. Was this any point when you're coping special anymore? And you're coping anymore, I'm sure woman depending on heaven. They cast a pie heaven. See, can one wine, you don't see a bejan. It's a no yan man. Okay. And the monyam poor best of my heaven, what they are good to a boy. And finally, it is the will of God that all men would have their freedom to worship Him, or okay. all men would worship Him alone as God. Pastor, on Sarah, they catch a Moses, Uncle Kanche Pharisee, Mammy Manfonko, no Munkongo Summer. That is the will of God. 
He wants people to be free. It is not the first thing ever. I am going to put on the map. Send your elder right now so can his freedom. Or see who he uh, or see uh, you shall know the truth and the truth will set you free. Okay. Or you should catch your ban or subran or John chapter four. Or see baby ban. Who is going Jerusalem? You. The only thing I Jerusalem can be here for better. He wants us to be free to what three months and every corner. The peer you assume you are your first day Jerusalem. Tika wa wuni passport mi amini passport ye be kwa yin. Wa wuni ska be fa plain ka ba den wa kwa kwosom. O ba den wa wuni ankopo. Ben wa yin so free for us to say ben tino e ya na i pity those people that put impediment before people hindering them from serving God. Those people no obi obi na juma. O e Christo ni kwasi ada no asesa no mo ne na busu afo kwa asori. No aka obi ti obi ba ti dia se da obi na bo fo ni ni ti fi no aka ni ti aso so on paper there. I know your costume, your meal, your genie freedom. Meanwhile, by the name of your Galatians, was see in Christ Jesus, there is no slave, there is no free man. We are all the same, we should all be free to serve the Lord. It's in the power of Boa to enhance the worship of God. We be our car, when I'm cross over Frank or Father, so I only get in a tea. Most of all, Boa Momo sweating us from Yanko Ponsango for Yamiani Jomo, no majority say, Heaven be here, dear. Until when we do the will of God, send you a day to do me any be bra, one cast out in the way to be kind. All right, so when we do the will of God, <clears throat> then we will definitely end up in heaven. Beloved, this is the awakening on HSM TV, and we are talking about the journey to the celestials or the celestial journey. I believe that as we were <clears throat> so keenly, uh, I mean, that the appetites for the kingdom of God were wet last week, and then we, we looked at how the kingdom of heaven looks like and everything. Now we want to look at the life that will actually take us to heaven, and we were made to understand that. It is a life of freedom, a freedom from bondage and then the snares of the enemy, a life under the lordship of our Lord Jesus Christ. And that is what uh, is going to take us there, a life that is according to the will of the Lord Jesus Christ. Um, I, I would like to ask, um, you know, from what we have said, realize that if someone must have this life, then that person mu mu must be a Christian. As though for emphasis sake, I want, I want to ask this question that does it mean that heaven is for Christians alone? <laughs> it's heaven for Christians alone. Uh, for the, from the other, who is a Christian? Mm. Because if we claim by the definition of a Christian, then we know that we, if indeed the question can be yes or no. If someone's definition of a Christian is someone who goes to church, then the answer is no. Mm. <laughs> but if someone's definition of a Christian is the one that does the will of God, that surrenders his life totally and living sheepishly and doing the will of God, and that is the definition for a Christian, mm. just as was given in Antioch, mm -hmm. then we can say that because you can never say that you've submitted yourself wholly to christ and yet will not see christ in you because yes. i don't the day the bible says christ in you is the hope of glory mm -hmm. which means that glory that is to be seen is that christ which is in you yes. so if that christ is me then it will be revealed and the christ that was revealed through them that was what they were called christians so if if the definition of christian per the bible mm -hmm. is what we are referring to then we can say that yes but then if it's a worldly definition or this redefinition of what we call christians then i will say no because the word determines christian by somebody who is part of a fellowship or an association they see in the church as an association of fellowship that the, the that person attend church and believe in a supreme being or a deity and then and, and, and that's all okay that's what they believe and for that reason they think that when we refer to someone as christian someone who goes to church if that's a definition for a christian then I'm sorry, then that is not it. Okay. But then, if the definition of a Christian as per the scriptures is what we refer to, yes, as Christian, then I will say that yes, because the Bible has said emphatically that Christ in us is the hope of glory. Which means that the Christ in you is the magnet for the hope. Mm. Is that one that will catch that? That's what he said. He has seen that with the spirit for the day of what? Redemption. Redemption. Which means that spirit is the Christ in you. And then the best magnet is about to be in the Okay. <laughs> All right. So Christ in us, the hope of love. You know, I was asking with the, you know, I, I wanted to be, 
you know, lay some emphasis on the fact that one needs to accept the Lordship of Jesus Christ before that person can be uh, uh, sure of uh, be being able to make it to heaven. With the view that there are other people who know Jesus as their brother. There are other people who know Jesus as uh, a miracle worker who just came to pass. There are other people who know Jesus as a certain prophet or something. But then we, we want to lay an emphasis on it that Jesus must be your Lord. Yeah. You must accept him as your Lord and Savior before you'll be able to make it to heaven. And once you accept the Lord Jesus as your uh, Savior and you live a life that is in accordance with his will, then you can be called a Christian. A, a true Christian, actually. Uh, Pastor, you wanted to add something yeah, to it? Just a scripture to support the meaning. You can one, one can. You see, Pastor, see, I can say you have to accept the Lord as your Lord. Who is Lord? Mm -hmm. Somebody you serve. Mm -hmm. You need to serve Christ. Exactly. To be a serv you need to be a servant of Christ uh, for Him to be your Lord. And you know, I said, now what can perfectly said? We be on my soul. Did you say yes? You by who was sorry? Oh yes. Oh, well, fine gentleman, yes. <laughs> it's kind. I never knew cried. I'm a kind of, so, but <laughs> he's not serving the Lord. Mm. It is an air that rightly said, perfectly said, the radiation, mm. uh, the distinction was drawn swiftly. Mm. And when it, said, it depends on how we define a Christian. Christian. A Christian is somebody that serves Christ, right. a servant of Christ, totally given to Christ. It is a small phone, as a man who can say, as of the apostles, is it chapter 4 or chapter 3? Or say, Omuti Peter and one seminary share saying ago, they took knowledge that they had been with Christ. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So they, they got to know, say, no, this these are people who are devoted to the Christ, they are serving the Christ. Oh no, more can be a Christ. In so called an abaca Christ. Oh, could you about Christ? Be be a Christ. Be be a Christ. And a Christian so I can John chapter 12, verse 26. Or see, if any man serve me, let him follow me. And where I am. There, there shall be. also my servant be. Uh -huh. If any man serve me, him will my father honor. Christ over him, ye you not get to heaven. And I'll see the obey dinner chin no best sum no no. Say any pan back heaven. No more di Christ or chis sum mono. Almost some pa any Christ or so more than a dinner mere fro more a Christ of all. It in yes ya woman to me, and then say be a me kubi. Name if you are serving and following Christ as Lord, then surely heaven is for Christians. And it's so established. All right. So it is established as that that heaven is for those who are following Christ, those who have uh, taken it upon themselves to serve Christ and Him alone, to make Him their master and then their their savior. So that is that. So we, if you just tune in, this is the awakening on HSM TV. We are talking about uh, the journey to the celestials, and then we've been uh, wanting to find out what the criteria is or what the requisite lifestyle is for one who wants to be able to make it to heaven and i believe that uh, the lord through my panelists have made it very clear for us what it takes for one to be able to make it to heaven which is uh being under the lordship of the lord the living the will of the uh, the lord jesus christ and all that and you can also send your views your questions your contributions to our whatsapp number zero five zero triple four zero two five six zero five zero four 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 zero two five six i was going to ask this question that how does life under the lordship of christ jesus look like but i believe that uh, one way or the other you spelt it out in, in your contribution so i want to look at how can we interrelate the lordship of jesus even as we experience him here on earth and his kingdom as in heaven um, if 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 i should pick that from mm -hmm. all aspects first we've been talking about jesus as lord okay and then we say he's his lord over his lord over that maybe his lordship if we have to expand it clearly mm -hmm. then we need to know who he is mm -hmm. if we are to talk of jesus who jesus is then clearly we say that jesus jesus is the son of god and the messiah who was crucified for all humanity okay resurrected for the justification of us for as many as believe in him so he, he's the son of god okay he was crucified for all humanity, but he was resurrected for the justification of as many as believe in him. Mm. He died for all, but for you to become beneficiary of his justification, you need to first believe in him. Okay. Having this basic understanding that Jesus Christ is the Son of God, literally, then what he is okay. is that he is God. Okay. And that is what is so much difficult for people to understand mm. to get who he is 
we've seen his passage and it spells clear that he's the son of god that means he came out as a being as a man he was killed the evidence is to show except the one who just want to live like your stretch and tell that oh, he's not true like keeping your only your head in the sun and with all your body left out there that you're hiding mm -hmm. that you because jesus christ wasn't crucified in someone's bedroom sure. he wasn't poisoned <laughs> yeah assuming that maybe jesus christ was poisoned mm -hmm. and nobody saw his death mm -hmm. then that would have been a different thing he was openly put to shame mm -hmm. openly put to shame publicly put to shame and to be able to see a runner who be able to see a child in pray who be able to see a body ascend him yeah i'm gonna send him down and now one hour i don't know how the truth i don't hear it now correct he hung there to death mm. again to he wasn't just hung as an individual only he was hung with some people so if not for anything if you didn't, if you didn't know there was a distinction between him and the others it shows clearly and the evidence is even till now that indeed jesus christ died so whosoever doesn't believe in his death is a different you know together mm some accept all of this philosophy all of uh, uh, let me know philosophy or all of this truth mm. that jesus christ was crucified no ambiguity about that jesus christ resurrected that is where they have a problem <laughs> many people do not even the jews some of them do not accept the fact or if they accept that he resurrected then it points to that he's god mm. and that was what they were always fighting with him whenever he made mention that he's god Said I, my father, I want them to pick that stone that will stone you. Why just you and your I, I, Abraham, Abraham saw my name before Abraham. I am. Hey, until I just, I am. So you use natural laws. Then by just only you and your uncle. Then they pick up stones. I could do that. Open so you and your uncle. So they pick up stones. So if they accept his resurrection, then it means that his lordship is clear, defined okay. in their concept. So it's difficult for them to accept his resurrection. So that's why I said that Jesus Christ, who he is, is that he's the son of God, which he expressly stated that he's the son of God mm. on earth. Then he went on to say that he is crucified, one who was crucified for all humanity. Mm. He had no sin. Pilate said there's no sin in him. Yeah. Yet they crucified, so he chose clearly that he came and it was stated in, in Azar that he, he will die for us. Exactly. So he shows clearly that he died for us, not because for himself. And again, he wasn't killed. Mm. He died. He gave himself up. Because looking at the torture, I think there are books that testify that they look at the torture that he went through. Normal human being, normal mortal would have even died along the line. But then he gave up the ghost. Which means that just as the Lord through Pastor Enoch you know, even stated earlier, you know, said, Do you think that I do not have soldiers, legions, about 12 legions even to fight for me? But uh, he chose not to do all of that. That means he willingly gave himself. Just as First Timothy chapter three verses, this is a mystery without controversy that God came in the flesh. Yeah, First uh, First Timothy three sixteen. Then it says clearly that indeed Jesus Christ came to die. Then whosoever will be justified through his resurrection are the people that believe. Now some people also believe that Jesus Christ resurrected. Yes, some people believe that yes, Jesus Christ died. Yes, he was killed. Yes. But yet, they find it difficult to accept that Jesus Christ is God. Mm. And 1 Timothy 3 I said, This is the mystery. When you have a Christian, you should be there to give us a Okay. 1 Timothy chapter 3, verse 16. And without controversy, mm. great is the mystery of godliness. Mm. God. Mm. God mm -hmm. was manifest mm -hmm. in the flesh, mm -hmm. justified in the spirit, mm -hmm. seen of angels, okay. preached unto the Gentiles, believed on in the world, received up into, into glory. glory. Mm. This is a mystery that God Himself came. Mm. Jesus also in his ministry made it clear to them that He is God. When you read uh Colossians 1, well, let's read uh, John 14:9. John chapter 14 verse 9. John chapter 14 verse 9. Yes, sir. Jesus saith unto him, mm -hmm. Have I been so long time with you, and yet hast thou not known me, Philip? Mm -hmm. He that has seen me has seen the Father. And how sayest thou then, show us the Father? Mm -hmm. He showed clearly that he that has seen me has seen, seen the, the Father. Father. 
Now, there's a globally accepted fact without provocation that man is a tripartite being, mm. and I think this thing you stated earlier on that man is made up of what a body, body soul, and spirit. soul, and legion of spirit. First Peter, I uh, first John chapter 5, verse 7 also states clearly. Seven, the seven and the eight. The eight speaks about those. There are three that bear record in earth, the, uh, the water, the blood, and there are three that bear record in heaven: the the, the 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 Father, the Word, and the Spirit. And these three are one. Now, if God also in Genesis made it clear that He made man in His own image after His own likeness, then it believed that God also is a tripartite being. If God is a tripartite being, how then can we then justify this in the in in in, the, in its fullness? Because Jesus said, "He whosoever has seen me." has seen the father mm -hmm. we would try to use isaiah the book of isaiah chapter 9 verse 6 coupled with what jesus said to justify the tripartite being of god that jesus christ is the same as the holy ghost jesus christ is the same as the father okay as pastor you there isaiah chapter 9 verse 6 yes sir. isaiah chapter 9 this is one to us Verses. Unto us a son, uh, uh, Isaiah chapter nine verse six. For unto us a child is born, yeah. unto us a son is given. The yeah. government shall be upon his shoulder. Yeah. His name shall be called Wonderful. Okay. Counselor. First, Wonderful Counselor. Mm -hmm. The Mighty mm -hmm. God. Mighty God. Everlasting Father. Everlasting Father. The Prince of Peace. And the Prince of Peace. Good. Now, when we read Isaiah chapter nine verse six, it's spelled out that his name is what wonderful. the Wonderful Counselor. The mighty God, mm. the everlasting Father. All these acronyms, all these titles were given to a son mm. that was born, mm. a child. Mm. How can the child be the mighty God? Mm. Mm. How can the child be the everlasting Father? Mm. And, and how can that same child and the praise at the same time? And how can that same child be the wonderful counselor? Mm. We believe and know in the scriptures that the Holy Ghost, the Holy Ghost was given and said that he's your counselor. Mm. Again to you. Now Colossians chapter 1, verse 15 and, and verse 15 to 19. He says that I think if you may have the mammy born the first as in the brain. Colossians 1 15. 15. He says to 19, yeah. Who is the image of the invisible God, mm. the firstborn of every creature? Yeah. And I think I think we, we, we can. We can end there. Okay. I think to the 19, our, our listeners can even uh, read all of that. We do. Jesus Christ, first, he is the image of the invincible God. Mm. The image of the invincible God. Man is a tripartite. You said man is a soul, has a soul, a body, and a spirit. Right. Then we begin to see first, if we are to define the Father in, in his totality, then we can see that then the Father, now, he said, the Bible says God is a spirit, and they that worship my worship in truth and in spirit. Mm -hmm. So we can see God as the spirit. Right. So the Bible says that in the beginning, the spirit the, uh, 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 hovered upon, brood of all the surface of the earth, and the Lord God spoke in all of that form. So God himself being the spirit mm. and as man also is a spirit said so that the spirit will go back to the father okay. and the soul will stand before judgment and the body will go to dust just as the bible makes it clear for us to know so god now okay stands in as the father then in that form then jesus christ being the express image of the father nobody said nobody has seen the father except the son, the son. and nobody has seen the son he said you do not know the son except the father and him that the son revealed uh, let me get the quotation right. Uh, that's Luke chapter 10, verse 21 to 22. Is there? And, and that, what I just said, uh, Luke chapter 10, verse 21 to 22, is stated clearly there. And then, then uh, when you read John chapter 10, verse 10, uh, John 10, 30, he said, I and the Father are one and all of that. Yeah. Now, it tells clearly that Jesus Christ is the express image of God revealed. Just as the Bible has made that clearly, uh, stated clearly in here. Again, to you, when we go on to say that now the father being the spirit as well and the bible says that spirit uh, so the father is the spirit then the word jesus christ being the word just as in first john chapter 5 verse 7 says that there are three that record in heaven the father the word and the spirit mm -hmm. now the word is revealed in revelation chapter 19 verse 11 to 22 the bible makes it clear to understand that the, i saw a man whose eyes were as flaming he was sitting on a horse and then also that he also sat on the throne and from him to, uh, from his mouth proceeded swords and then and he had a name that nobody knew and that name written is the word the word of god so jesus christ 
which means that it tells clearly that Jesus Christ on earth was referred to as Jesus, but just as we or when we go to heaven, we'll be given a name. He also has a name, and his name is the Word of God, which is revealed in John chapter 1, verse 1 to is that in the beginning uh, was the Word, and the Word was God, and the Word was God. So the Word Himself was God, which means that Jesus is God, and the Spirit is God, and the Father is God, the Son is God, and the Spirit is God. Then it goes on, no one, he said, no one has seen the, uh, um, against you, the Holy Spirit or the, or the Holy Ghost is the soul, if we should put it right, just as a man. So we have the soul. Now, Jesus Christ made it clear to them when he said that in John chapter 14, verse 16 to 18, John 14, 16 to 18, okay. John chapter 14, verse 16 to 18. I will pray the Father, mm -hmm. and he shall give you another comforter, mm -hmm. that he may abide with you forever, mm -hmm. even the spirit of truth, mm -hmm. whom the world cannot receive, mm -hmm. because it sees him not, mm -hmm. neither knoweth him, mm -hmm. but ye know him. For he dwelleth with you, with you, and shall, and shall you. hold on. For he dwelleth with you, not, not, not because he dwelleth, he was dwelling or he will dwell with you. He said mm -hmm. he dwelt, which means he was speaking to them at that present, mm -hmm. which means currently, as Jesus was speaking to them, he was dwelling with them. And he said, and Sha, which means when he comes again, this time he's not going to dwell with you. First, God revealed himself as God, the dweller among us, God, the God, the man or the God that dwells with us. But now he's God revealed in us, so he's going to be in us. Then the verse is, and I will not leave you comfortless. I will come to you. <laughs> See, <laughs> now, <laughs> he reveals that he said that what who will be sent will come is him. Who he who will come is him. Mm. This time around, Jesus came in the body form to represent the Father and the Spirit. So when the Spirit also needed to be represented while he was even baptized, he had to come in the form of a dove because. He needed a form also to represent. Here lies the case that Jesus, when he was on earth, he was operating as a man. And so he, he, was, he let me put it if right, that he had limitations. He had to transport to one place before he does certain things. Now, this time around, because he is in the spirit, and if we should put it right, the spirit is the soul. And now he said, I will draw, he shall draw in you. So whosoever submit himself to the lordship of Jesus and accept, the, accept that Jesus Christ is God, then Jesus Christ come to be his soul. He come to dwell in him. So which means your soul will not do that which is evil. That's why he said that he that is born of God cannot do evil. That means you begin to do that which Jesus is. So you begin to live as Jesus. That's why he said he that is in you, not he that is for you. He said he that is in you is greater and mightier than he who that is in the world. Which means Christ who is in you. How did this Christ come to you? He came to live inside you because he said that he shall be in you. And I will not leave you comfortless. Before then, he stated that the uh, uh, spirit of truth is a comforter. And he said, I will not leave you comfortless. I will come to you. So it's Jesus who also is now with us as a spirit. So that's the reason why so it's not far from right. When some writers give it that Holy Ghost. So in the other chief I say, Samai <laughs> But that cannot be. So we're talking of Jesus, who is now in the spirit form, dwelling in us, not dwelling with us, but in us. So he begin to operate in us. So when you see me, you should not see me, but you begin to see Jesus manifesting. Mm. That is what, with the first definition of who can be in heaven, a Christian, now matters. Because that is the seed, that spirit that is in you. That, means that seed is in you. And that seed in you is the soul of Christ. And that soul of Christ is his spirit. So in other words, if... Uh, until one comes to this acceptance to know Jesus and to accept he being God and his lordship I, 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 one cannot have an I, 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 I think this is, is one of the sinners prayer that we pray whenever mm -hmm. someone comes to surrender to Jesus mm -hmm. said I to this day I accept Jesus to be my God I believe that Jesus Christ is Lord mm -hmm. he died for my sins now you accept his lordship first you accept that Jesus is God mm -hmm. and now I take him as God mm -hmm. I accept him to be my God because he is God if you say as God that means that there is he's representing a God mm. but he's not representing a God just as some teachers begin to think that okay Jesus was one of the angels or the uh, uh, celestial beings who was uh, God was looking for someone to send and said yeah hey, daddy I'm, I'm around and he said send me you know, and, uh, it draws my uh, attention to the um, what um, is stated in Philippians chapter 2 verse uh, 9 following that at the mention of his name every knee in heaven on the earth shall bow. Correct. So if there is any other body, correct, who is God aside Jesus, Jesus. would that need bow? bow? 
<laughs> you, you realize that it was so hard for the for, for the Jews to accept mm. that Jesus is God. Mm. So he had to present himself as a son of God mm. because he presented himself with the bodily form that he has presented. Mm. So as a son of God. So this same son of God, when his fullness was revealed, when John saw him, he said, I lie prostrate as one dead. Because he saw his totality. Mm. <laughs> Mm. <laughs> he is God. It was writings. Thomas, Thomas said it when he doubted, and the Lord told him to touch him. He then confessed, "My Lord and my God." Uh -huh. You will never see that. Yes, mm. and even uh, uh, Matthew chapter fourteen, verse three, and Matthew chapter twenty-eight, verse nine, Jesus accepted worship as God. Mm. When first, when he walked on the on on the on the on the on, on the water, and again when he resurrected in Matthew chapter twenty, verse nine. When they began to watch him, if indeed he was, as people presume, that maybe he was one of the angels, some archangel, that uh, accepted the call and came, and, and uh, so now he has been exalted, so God is there, and Jesus is somewhere, my friend, then he wouldn't, no angel would accept, accept worship. Mm. But he accepted worship. He is God. Mm. There's no ambiguity. Or say, wait, any mystery, no? Without controversy. Mm. He never said the Son of God. He said God mm. revealed, came in the you flesh. Know, sometimes I'm, I'm of the understanding that you know we, we, we talk about God Himself coming to die. God is God is a being of His word, yeah. and it's His word that binds Him. And He said that surely when man eats of this, man shall surely die. So to avert that eternal death, it means over his dead body. I just will be not saying sorry. I'm saying as I said, let me ask you. So until say Nyanko po na ngasa ba be wo, that death could not be corrected. You see, until man mm. and until every there are many Christians that go to church, they've surrendered their life to Jesus, and yet they think Jesus is uh, some angel be, and then God is there. Supernatural, be and yes, you know, so on a baby, and to only say, uh, uh, or on a second in command, but yeah. there are seven different gods, <laughs> <laughs> but God is one, yeah. God is one, just as we humans, mm. we are three, and that trapata be you know, and as a self, even when you do yoga, if you are four, you don't for yoga, or no, no, or, or crossing, and they teach in schools, there are ways you and you begin to chant some, your spirit will just leave your body, you are here, and your spirit will leave your body, and can be someone on the road. If not, you so can, you can with. explain with the dreams we have. Oh, yes. You have a dream, and then you are somewhere, you wake up, you feel it within your sure, body that sure. this has taken oh, place. So be sure, mm. so be sure. Mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, I'll come to you again, but then if you just tune in, this is The Awakening on HSM TV. Uh, the topic still remains the journey to the celestials as we get into understand what it takes for one to be able to make it to the celestials. And we've got into ascertain that indeed it takes the acceptance of the Lordship of Jesus Christ and doing the will of Jesus Christ to be able to make it. And for that reason, uh, the Lord through my panelists were trying to expatiate uh, for us to get to accept the Lordship of Jesus Christ so that we'll be able to gain that entry permit into the kingdom of heaven. Pastor, I don't know if you want to add up something to what Doc was saying. Uh, Pastor, uh, uh, in fact, all have been said, mm. but let me add something small to Senor Kaka. The way he started it, I, I like it that way. Mm. So you need to establish who Jesus is mm. before you can even talk about his loss being linked to heaven. Because you need only buy our way out. Okay. You cannot link him to heaven. It is saying your account once and then it, ha it all has to do with the senior pastor with the view my you know, the redemption plan of God. Mm. How God could redeem man. Mm. So because you see, senior your account once and say it's, it's so talking about the who Jesus is now. Let me add a little to it. Just like okay, and I'm just reiterating what he says, some things he said. We can divide them into three. One, the being. His nature. Mm. And then I am a Swami and then it is very true. Say there is only one and true God. But then he has revealed himself to be triune. Say the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Mm. So and I'm going to say And what then what he said, ja. Or then what he said, Oba. Or then what he said, Oba. Mm. Or then what he said, Oba. Now we give you so in your cup. And Oba so Oba they give you so in your cup. Oba say Oba now give you so in your cup. Amen. And then the next one I want to go with is the essence. Okay. 
why would God do that? I mm. <laughs> For what? So, and Miami and San were purpose, and it was to complete or to fulfill his redemptive or redemption plan. Okay. And I said, you see, God became the son for a specific purpose, All right. which was to carry out his redemption plan for his most loved and wonderful creation called human. So, the love God has for human, no, that pushed him right. to reveal himself in that way. So, I want the olden people. No? He now reveals himself as the son, not for anything, no. mm. senior pastor can to come down to be able to die. So over his dead body, mm. he wouldn't retract his word. Exactly. Over his dead body, so he needs to die. Mm. And how would he die? He must come as a son in the flesh form. So that is the essence. The plan could the plan included bringing a savior who would be the express image of God. Senior can was him such that in the form of God. Mm. To be able to do what only God can do. And also to impact the life of God once again into man. The pastor said in our kind of it 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 warranted a being and as will be a or what the life of God within him. Exactly. That eternal life, the life that never ceases. Mm. But then also what the element of man. Mm. To be able to finish the part of man and also finish the part of God and then bridge them together. Mm. That is the reconciliation because I want to baby. The gap was too big. How could it be bridged? The reconciliation process, you know, needed for God to come as uh, a son. Our book quotations means I am a subiu. Again, uh, it was to settle the death of man, mm. so which is death mm. fully. But Jesus, God had to come in the form of human as the Son Jesus to be able to die as man, because the wages of sin is death. Mm. And God told Adam and Eve, the day you do this, you will die. Sure. So that sentence had to be met. And it may be me cancer rather than a musu chim says and ka Adam na and ke uwa jenibonia and I am you we we don't have that element of God mm. to, to die and then raise ourselves back again to life. And to ke we can one no and tika one and ke u the agenda. Ke we won in one key and watch the go say mo. So there had to be somebody that had a part of God and a part of man. Hundred percent God, mm. not fifty percent too, hundred percent God. And hundred percent anti Christian so by no obua papa minim so obua papa me jidi adan ho adi eno ma bi mu aye nyankopon ko na betimi aye like breaking the laws of nature say na na me no e ka say no e limited he was limited because he wanted to limit himself e to e do baby an person of breaking the limitation he broke it he walked on water from the sea yes there were chance he turned to the wind speaking to the wind and they obeyed him so it was created actually the man without eyes is God who the man creates. Eyes, he created. Mm. And then the show phone said, When you pump a crump on so they were wondering, Can a man do this? When we say, When you pump a to make us a map, and we will be the law. Mm. Mm. When the lady that was caught in adultery mm. came, sometimes we believe he's, a, he's stooped down to write. When he was giving the law to them, he wrote on the ground on the stone for them. So if it was really kept in their hearts, and they caught the lady in that form and he need to reverse that law to them mm. then he needed to write again so he stood down to write mm. then after he wrote then he asked them no <laughs> you're born on to war then if that law has been rewritten that means there's grace mm. and titus makes it understand that for the grace of god that brings us up has not appeared to all men mm. and you, grace over judgment mm. i know as a sign you when this one God bless. Uh, Pastor, uh, the last aspect I want to add to the enemy you can about the nature being God in three ways, our uh, done worthy, and then the essence, you know, mm. as in why he did that, you know. Now the claim. Okay. So the last part I want to talk about is the claim. Why do we claim? So say Jesus Christ is that person mm. that is able to bring that salvation. Mm. Why do we claim that? So we claim that because you see, many people have come to this world to impact the lives of people positively. But nobody met the description of the Savior God gave. Yeah. So Nyanko Pon said that Chirai Seni Ajen Kwana Obeba No Seni also see. Yeah. And nobody fits that description <coughs> better than Jesus. Yeah. In fact, Jesus meets all the description, the criteria. Now Nyanko Pon, my first, so me will say the Savior should be a seed of man. Mm. So and that seed of man was promised to Abraham and subsequently to Jacob. Mm. So was Sinimu. And was Jesus the, uh, the seed of Abraham? 
Sure. Was he man when he came? <laughs> so he met that criteria. Genesis 3, 15, Genesis 22, 18, Matthew 1, 1 to 17. Again, or say Jesus, uh, the Savior was to be born of a virgin. Was Jesus born of a virgin? Nipa Ben or was as if you are chin and kaya so or Babunu na won. Ni ma meni ni papa nyewe. Ni ma meni o bema biya nyewe no awonu me what be da. Ninti be da. It's only Jesus that made that criteria where well, uh, Isaiah 7 14. And when you read Luke chapter 1 verse 26 downwards, you find it Matthew 1 18, you find it over there. Again, I say the Savior was to be a branch of Jesus' root. Specifically, after so I seed of Abraham, after so I seed of Jacob, no. If you are so a so here and my will free Jesse. As you know, we're talking about Jesse, then we are talking about David. David yeah. And you can read Matthew chapter 1, verse 1 down, verse 1, 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 any Jesse more now again, sending another boss in you know, Isaiah 53, he was supposed to suffer wrongfully. Mm -hmm. So, he was supposed to suffer. I will be so I see I can't try to me. So, oh, please, he made any America. I'm not doing any comparison analysis. Be a moment, Jesus has met all the criteria. Okay, but he was supposed to suffer wrongfully. Isaiah 53 8 to 10. And yet, sending your head, I can once say, Luke chapter 23, verse 4. Pilate to see, I find no fault mm -hmm. in this man. Oh, yeah, Bonnie, be a and then the law and another one i want to add to is he was to see no corruption mm -hmm. the resurrection aspect say the david kind of uh, some 16 10 or say uh you will not leave my soul mm -hmm. in, in in the grave yeah going to be corrupted again he was to be declared as the son of god pastor me the way he he was to be declared as the son of god mm -hmm. and that declaration was made in matthew chapter 3 verse 16 and 17. the lord god almighty made that declaration Matthew 17 5. He made a declaration. This is my beloved son. Mm. Listen to him. And then the, the next one is he was to be betrayed and sold. You see, Pastor, we are making Kenyan to, 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 to bring out the claim. Ah, yeah, because Jesus is the only person that fits to be a savior. It's so true. Because all the criteria God gave, and as if Savior will be the share that as a from different dispensations. Yeah. And different people who never met. Mm. David ni Isaiah, and Chaka Ben no more. <laughs> David ni Zachariah, mm. Chaka Ben no more. But they will all say things that just say chronologically. So, okay, come on, say, where can I, where can I, see, 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 we are saying back. All put together, Pastor, the entire America said the Lordship of Jesus can never, never be separated from heaven. And I said the, the Lordship of heaven, the Lordship of Jesus is connected to heaven. And I said, after we've gotten to know, so Jesus meets that criteria of a savior, and then he is the God that reveals himself in three ways. You know, then what are we supposed to do? We need to accept and confess him as Lord. Okay. We need to bow to him in obedience mm -hmm. because one, he alone has that eternal life. Sure. Pastor, heaven I can say it's all about eternal life. Mm -hmm. The life in heaven is eternal life. And a first John 5 11 or see god has given us eternal life uh -huh. and that life is in his son yeah it is your person and corner across your heaven and again he owns that soul right or singular right to judgment jesus is a judge mm. he's going to judge every soul it is he is going to declare whether depart or enter mm. whether you are acquitted or condemned he is going to declare that mm. and finally he owns the heaven or no, I have any idea. Or no, and I have when you read first Timothy chapter six now. Uh, or small for poor can was it say so he's a king, so he's a king that draws in, in that light, immortal light. Having one year who say hi or one year high by or no, you're here now, or dwelling in the kingdom. So again, when Jesus came to the earth, it was the integration of the kingdom. Matthew 4 17. So I say after your shrine in a day, I pay pastor ever since the beginning of preaching. Uh, about God or letting God, uh, letting people know about God. Nobody has thought on the kingdom of heaven for us to know clearly like Jesus did. Nobody. Don the Baptist boy cast a woman such a man you in a bay. That was what he said. But Jesus came and then gave us everything about heaven, how it is like, how we are going to get there. Mm. In fact, He is the beginning of heaven. He is the heaven. I am the way. He is the, the way and life. So. Mm -hmm. There is no other there's no other way, there is no other means. And Pastor, you see, when he came to earth, one thing he did that amazes me. He demonstrated the power of heaven on earth. Sure. He did that when he silenced all the demons, when he casted demons out of people, 
when he did all those things people could not just fathom it they could not just uh, uh, accept it or imagine and say ah how is this impossible and then a nipa timi kasana bbf 12 you nipa ni mu and that thing is a being on itself like the man the legion two thousand demons a free nipa ma hakumo jino mo chete ni only jesus came and they manifested the power of the kingdom to people to know say there is actually a kingdom i've told you about it this is how it is and then he showed the kingdom to us and he is the king of the kingdom so you cannot separate the lordship of jesus from heaven now i forgot to say the issue the only one ready only the team we didn't say be our ad for and also a software and also a simple kenny but we need to say you're ready now for one share i said yeah and heaven now also person called the mc jama the old one but i say <laughs> Colossians 1 16 says for by him were all things created that are in heaven mm. Mm. all things created that are in heaven and the dying for fair can was in here they were created by him that are in create uh, that are in heaven that are in earth mm. visible and the invisible whether they be thrones or dominions mm. or principalities or powers all things we created by him mm. and for him mm. and he is before all things and by him all things consist you know <laughs> it, 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 it's a clear picture when the lord jesus was speaking about the banquet uh, and then you know he is the, the 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 owner of the banquet as in the the banquet is being made because of him so he sets a criteria so until you meet that standard of his any any way by which you want to enter there you're a thief sure. and you should be dealt with as a as a thief so until you have you've come to accept him to meet his standard yeah. it means that there is no way we can go to him or we, we can live with him um I, I, I'll, I'll, I I'll, I'll give you a moment to okay. talk but then i want to announce the phone lines real quickly uh, maybe time will permit us to uh, just pick a few calls but then if you want to add your voice to the program the number is 0322 Four nine six seven one four zero three two two four nine six seven one five zero three two two four nine six seven one four zero three two two four nine six seven one five. I've been um, skipping a few a few messages for quite some time now. I just want to read this one. It says, "Wow, God richly, richly, richly bless you, Pastor and your panelists. These teachings are very deep and revealing. The Awakening Program is indeed awakening." And this is from Brother Christopher. God bless you so much, Brother Christopher, for that message. This is also from. Nicholas Joyce from Paul and she says, Pastor, please God richly bless you all for such a profound discussion. We thank God for imparting in-depth knowledge into us through this program. It is my humble prayer that the good Lord will help us all to be found worthy to make it to heaven. God bless you too so much. Hello? All right, you can call the numbers on your screen 0322-496-714, 0322-496-714. One five and add your voice to the program, Doctor. You wanted to yeah, say something. I think last week the Lord Valerie. Okay. And I'm calling Pastor. God bless you, Pastor. Amen. 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 God bless you too so much, Pastor. You can also call the numbers on your screen and add your voice to the program. Doc, please. Yeah, I think last week the Lord by his message through you made mention that when we talk jesus christ the king of kings and the lord of lords mm. we're not thinking about oh, just the earthly ones because all in heaven they are with crowns and they are all kings mm. now if there was any other king greater than jesus the bible says in revelation chapter 19 verse 16. hello 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 yes please your name and where you're calling from Please, my name is Eunice. I'm calling from Ayesia. All right, Eunice. Please go ahead and speak. Um, please, I want, just want to say that um, it's amazing how some Christians would say, oh, this one is going to cause to you hate our, uh, our own way. Mm. But what we have to do is that he is the way, mm. the truth and the life. How mm. can you go to God without going to God? Mm. 
He said to go. So for you to go to God, you have to go to him. Thank you very much. God bless you so much for that um, contribution. Uh, your sister Eunice, um, Dr. Yeah. The last I want to add to is that when you read uh, uh, Revelation 19, verse 16, yeah, and he said, and he that he has on his vesture true, sorry, he he has on his vesture and on his tie a name written King of Kings mm. and Lord of Lords. He's Hello. in heaven. <laughs> Hello. 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 Yes, please. Your name and where you're calling from, please. I'm calling from uh, our origin. Okay. My name is Andrew. All right, please. God bless you for the awful discussions you have there. Amen. Um, what I want to add is, um, if you look at Jesus Christ himself, mm. um, I just want to summarize it. Um, the, the, the reason why is the only way to heaven, simply because if you look at his birth, without fertilization, mm. all other founders of other religion, you can't get that. Mm. If you look at his um, resurrection from death, mm. all other founders die and they are still in their grave, mm. but the grave of Jesus Christ is empty. Mm. And you look at his ascension to heaven, the force of gravity has no effect on him. Mm. This should make it clear that he's the way to heaven. Mm. Thank you very much. God bless you so much. I say, O Pebe, we are going to be able to pay you. Only a dinner to you. We are to me, the answer is we are going to heaven pay. I can't use the Christ to a whole year later. So why not him? <laughs> Hello. 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 Yes, please. Your name and where are you calling from? Good evening. My name is Brother Steven. I'm calling from uh, a block of Malaysia. All right, Brother Steven Pacho. Go ahead. And I speak. tell this teaching is very, very interesting. Just a few minutes ago, I was discussing with my son. He was arguing with me that uh, Jesus is not God. We argue for a length. Mm. So I called him to listen to this your program. Now he's calling back that the he understand that now uh, Jesus Christ is God himself. Oh, yeah. hallelujah. <laughs> very, very interesting teaching. Thank, thank you God. and God bless you. Amen. God bless you too so much. We thank God. Dog. Uh, so, looking at what is stated clear mm. in Revelation chapter, nine, uh, Revelation chapter 19, mm. then it says that whose name is King of Kings mm. and Lord of Lords. That means he's God Almighty. He's the almighty king. He's the almighty lord. Hello. 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 Yes, please. Your name and where you're calling from. Uh, my name is Brother Fred, and I'm calling from Benefit Testament. All right, please. Okay. We thank the living God for giving us this thing. Mm. And I want to express myself on this topic too. Mm. Um, what we need to know is that there is a difference between the Father and God. Jesus is God and the Father is not revealed. That's why he said that Oh, it's cool. Um, Unfortunate. Uh, his line is dropped. I don't know if he was drumming home a point but uh <laughs> we lost him maybe you can come again but but what we know we have made clear and that is what can give one salvation which is believing in jesus who is god who is the same as the father he said i and the father are yeah, one hello yeah yes please hello hello yes uh, uh, please, uh, my name is Ledina. I'm calling from you. All right, please. We are listening. Uh -huh, please. I just want to uh, comment for the work you are doing. This is a good program mm. that you are doing. But I also wanted to add that our Jesus Christ is Lord. Mm. Because, you see, Christianity is not a religion. Mm. It is the only life 
of the divine life that God has given to us who truly believe in Christ Jesus. Mm. As long as we are here, we can argue. But then the first thing we know that is the only true word of God. And only through him, according to Colossians 2, was this word made. And he is our Savior. Thank mm. you for such a good program. God bless you. Amen. God bless you too. Um, yeah. Doctor, Again, I, I think that uh, we'll, we'll end the call segment uh, for the sake of our time. Doctor, please run up so that yeah. we call it a day. Again, when you read Titus chapter 2, verse 10, he said, Looking for that blessed hope mm. and the glorious appearing of the great God. So, great God, the other translation is the almighty God and our Savior. Who is he referring to? Mm -hmm. Then he goes on to say, Jesus Christ. Mm. Uh, uh, so mm. he tells he, he goes on. This is the mystery, this is the deeper understanding. Mm. These believers, these apostles came to realize about whom he, they were believing, about whom they were following then. If on earth they were maybe when he was on earth, maybe if they were thinking that he was just a son of God or a prophet, or just as they were assuming until Peter, when Peter revealed. They said, this is not revealed by flesh. Mm. Because Jesus himself said that nobody has seen the Father. Nobody knows the Father except the Son. And nobody knows the Son except the Father. Which it tells clearly that as he was even with them. But he said he's the Son of God. But he said nobody knows the, the Son. That means there is a mystery between within whom he's even referring to a Son. Which mm. means that he's not just a Son as you might think he is. And except and only those except the, like the Son. And those that the Son reveal to, which means that except the Lord Himself reveals to, you cannot get this. Mm -hmm. And by the grace of God, the Lord by His mercy has made the grace of God has, has appeared to them all. At all, uh, Titus two eleven. For the grace of God that bringeth salvation has appeared to them all, appeared to all men. Mm -hmm. And that grace of God is Jesus Christ, whom we are waiting for, who is God. Who is God the Father? Mm. Who is God the Son? Mm. And who is God the Holy Spirit? Mm. And He is the one that we're waiting for. Mm. If only we believe with our hearts that Jesus Christ is God and we accept His Lordship, mm. then where He is, there we shall also be. Where He is, there we shall also be. Pastor, I'll let you give me your last word uh, in, a, in a moment. But then there's a, um, a message from one of our brethren. Uh, Madam Jane from Takrad, and she says, In Jesus alone is life. Well said, Elder and Pastor Eno, God bless you. It is stated vividly in the Bible that Jesus is the only way, the truth, and life, and no one comes to the Father except through Him, meaning that no one can go to heaven except he or she is a true Christian. God bless you so much Amen. for that message. Pastor. Pastor, the last one I want to add to is uh, the aspect of the Christ, mm. Jesus being the Christ. Mm. Very important. Also, I, I think the answer of the apostles chapter 2 verse is it 26 or say God has made him Lord and Christ mm -hmm. so so as we are talking about his lordship we, we don't have to separate the Christ aspect from the lordship so the Christ to buy our year Christ to search said the was Serrano so he who has been anointed fully with the Holy Spirit you see what John chapter 14 and uh, John chapter 15 and 16 and what can Holy Spirit no one say? Mm. I, I will send him. I will send him. Yeah. I will send him. Mm. So now I say he's the possessor of the spirit. Exactly. And hence, say Romans chapter 8 verse 10. What purpose say? So be near Christ to whom we be on your So say any plan you are not part of heaven mm. because the same spirit that is leading us to the heaven. It's you know accepting the lordship of Christ and comes along uh, 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 the lordship of Jesus comes along with he being the Christ, mm. the anointed one. Nobody has been anointed. And then being the Christ, the anointed one, just say he's the possessor of the spirit with who, which, with whom he was anointed. And so he's the only one that can impart the Holy Spirit. Mm. Yeah. Osma Popo, Peter, or Cass and Pacheco, no, 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 
uh, uh, Matthew tells us in Matthew 1 21 say he is the one to deliver us from sin exactly pastor will be on one year delivered from sin no bet me a heaven no because last week about him you say heaven one no nothing that defiles shall enter there from revelation 21 27 nothing that defiles be being one more goofy bonnie woman a better heaven ho. and on me actually i say christian i was on quality me genie perfect bonnie any star set and two minute bonus if the sun sets you free it means you are free indeed it is a christian yes you can have a man from a better man from the free bonnie mudia then it means he's the only one that can help us to make heaven mm -hmm. as the christ again talking about the christ he's the one that is able to offer forgiveness of sin through his blood mm -hmm. delivery from the power of sin is different from being offered forgiveness so for all have sinned mm -hmm. and we are falling short of the glory of god falling short of the glory of god here today we cannot stay with the glory we are falling short of it mm -hmm. we don't qualify why because we are sinful but then or we'll see through the blood of jesus according to romans chapter 3 verse 25 colossians 1 14 ephesians 1 7 or we'll see through the blood of jesus we have been given forgiveness of sins and then the next one is to reconcile us to god or himself as we are talking say he is still the god he is still the same person you are talking about you know and to look at second corinthians 5 19 but on a colossians 1 20 mm. we'll see we have been reconciled to him he mm. is reconciling us to himself yeah. So without that reconciliation, mm. mm. so party for my enemy. And it can only be done through the Christ. Yeah. And then finally, he was anointed as a prophet to give the full counsel and revelation of God. Mm -hmm. Pastor, in fact, we <laughs> couldn't understand because Nicodemus didn't hadn't accepted him at that time to be his Lord. He didn't have the Holy Spirit of God, and so he couldn't factor on the full counsel and revelation of God. Right now, we are able to know God and know the full counsel of God and what He has for us mm. through Jesus Christ, His Son, who is God Himself, who has revealed Himself and given us His Spirit. Through so Jesus Christ, who is God Himself and has revealed Himself unto us and has given us His Spirit, beloved. This is how far time will permit us to come. There are a few more messages. Time wouldn't permit me to read all, but there's a message from our brother uh, Richard, and he says, In Jesus alone is life, please. Even the Pharisees persecuted Jesus because they said he acted like God. And <laughs> Jesus said, Before Abraham I uh, was, I am. So, how can Christians of today doubt his deity? And this means the Pharisees even understood him better. God yeah. bless you all. God bless you too for that message. Uh, there are a few more messages. This is also from uh, Ms. Sawa Italy, and she says, I am the Alpha and the Omega, and that proves that Jesus Christ mm. is God, that there is no one above him. God bless you too so much for that message. There are a lot more messages coming in, and I don't know, <laughs> time is not on my side to read all the messages, but this is also from uh, Evangelist Ampon Sam Maxwell. Um, he's from Osino, the Eastern region, and he says, Good evening, men of God. Such a wonderful and amazing program. May God increase, may God increase your fire. And Jesus is God. Many will miss heaven because of uh, this uh, ignorance. And he goes ahead to state some scriptures. First Corinthians chapter 8, verse 5, Deuteronomy chapter 6, verse 4, uh, John 1, verse 1 to 3, and then Romans chapter 9, verse 5. For the sake of our time, there are a lot more probably godling next week as we continue with our discussion. We will delve much deeper into some of these verses. This is the last message I'd like to read and then we'll call it a day. It says, and also um, Thomas exclaimed, my Lord and God, after the resurrection, Christ Jesus didn't stop him. And also when John bowed and worshipped him in Revelation chapter 1, he didn't stop him either. Though when John tried bowing to the angel before, he was stopped. Indeed, Christ Jesus it's is cool. Lord. And this is also another message from the same sender. He says, a couple of men were discussing how all religions were 
like different paths to the top of the mountain, meaning uh, leading to the same God. And a Christian listening close by heard them and replied, Do you mean all religions lead to God? <laughs> and the answer is saying yes. But then he went ahead to explain. If even all religions claim to lead to uh, the God on the mountain, in Christianity, God didn't wait for man to climb up to him. But he came down himself to bridge the gap between him and man. Indeed, he, uh, only he could lay his life down and then take it up again. And that is what God only can do. God bless you so much for that message. That is from uh, Sister Philippa. Uh, God bless you for sending that message. So we call it a day, beloved. This has been the Awakening on HSM TV. We thank the Lord so much. And God bless you for being a part of the discussion. I believe that there are so many messages in my whatsapp um uh, on my whatsapp message uh my whatsapp and then i wouldn't be able to read them all for the sake of our time and so please kindly bear with me god at the same time let's we could be coming your way with another edition of the awakening which i believe would continue with this topic of discussion so if you have any contributions do not uh, worry at all you can shelve it for god willing next week same time would come your way. Uh, we've been sponsored by Heaven Seekers Ministry, a ministry that is aimed at bringing the undiluted gospel of the Lord to the world, especially in these last days. You can call Heaven Seekers on 0275 0075-000961, 0075-000656, 0541-000656. You can also worship with us on Facebook at Heaven Seekers Ministry. Atonsu Dompase, Heaven Seekers Ministry, Atonsu Dompase, and also our website www.heavenseekersministry.org, where all live services are streamed, so you can also be a part of the service wherever you find yourself. Also, I've been sponsored by Modest Apparel Fashion, Win Win Driving School, Vidaf Products, and Isab Enterprise, Sum 138 Building and Construction Works, Desa Construction Works, and Sum 4 Metal Works, Sum 4 Metal Works. God will at the same time next week, as we said, will be coming your way. My name is Pastor Prince Crunchy, and I've been talking to my brethren here in the presence of Elder Dr. Samuel Kisi and Pastor Enoch Adair. God bless you so much for being a part of the program. God bless you for being a part of the program as well. God willing, we'll meet the same time next week. Until then, may the Lord keep us all. Bye-bye. Yeah.